In this video, I'm going to show you how to remove objects or people from any background in Adobe Photoshop. So let's get started. Alright, so here I am in Adobe Photoshop and here as you can see we got three people right here and we're going to be removing this dude right here so that we only have these two people left on the beach. So first of all select the object selection tool right here if it doesn't show for you just right click on it and select object selection tool from here and then make sure you have the layer selected on the layers window right here. Once you're done with that just draw a box around the person or the object you're trying to remove and then just wait for Adobe Photoshop to process the image. Once Adobe Photoshop has processed the image here as you can see it's done a pretty good job but over here as you can see it hasn't selected the whole of the surfboard so just zoom in to the area of the object or the person which Adobe Photoshop didn't select. Here as you can see it hasn't selected the surfboard part right here just zoom in and then over here make sure you have this mode selected right here and just draw around the object. As you can see, we have this blue part right here. You can just manually do that again by just selecting once again. Here, as you can see, it's done a pretty good job. And now once you're done with that, just zoom out and then go to select, hover over, modify and choose expand. Now here, just set it to 30, 20 or 10 pixels, depending on your image. I'm going to set it to 30 and then go to edit and click on content aware fill. And then once this window has opened up here, as you can see, we have a real-time preview of what Photoshop is doing right here. If I zoom in, as you can see, we can see the man completely disappeared from the image. And as you can see, Photoshop has done a pretty good job in removing the person or the object. Now over here, you can just paint on the areas where you don't want Photoshop to sample to remove the person. So now what Photoshop is trying to do is that it's sampling the area around the object or the subject and then trying to recreate it within the subject or the object. Now you can just paint on areas where you don't want Photoshop to sample. Let's say there is an image of a car. You can just select that so that it doesn't sample the car because it doesn't make sense to sample the car and add it anywhere else because that's not the main thing that Photoshop needs to sample. The main thing is to sample the seaside and this bridge right here, the sky and the sand or the shore over here. And now once you've done that, you can just click on OK and just wait for it to completely do its thing and then hit Ctrl D on your keyboard. And now over here, as you can see, Photoshop has completely removed that dude from this image. And over here, as you can see, it's created a new layer right here. And behind that, we have the man. And in front of that, we have this image right here that Adobe Photoshop created from the sample area around the subject or the object. And yeah guys, that's how you remove objects in Adobe Photoshop using the really handy tools that is the object selection tool and the content aware fill tool. And yeah guys, that's the end of this video. If you found this video helpful, make sure to give this video a like and share with a friend. And if you have any queries, you can put them down in the comment section below. And please hit the subscribe button to support me. Till then, see you later. Thanks for watching and I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.